birthmark just kind of appeared? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I don't know how long it's been here. It's weird. You don't think it had anything to do with the kiss? You don't say it like it didn't happen. No, I'm fully aware that it happened. It's just, I, um, I don't, I don't know what to do about it. You don't do anything about it. It happened. It quite possibly could have given me my powers and we move on. I mean, this is a good thing. Well, not necessarily. I mean, if the only way that I can transfer powers is by kissing people, then we have a slight problem. Well, what you did for me was just kind of unlock my hidden scar or birthmark thing. I don't know exactly how I got the powers that come with it. Because obviously the scar is just a symbol. I mean, you had your birthmark since birth, and you didn't even get your powers till you're 15. That's because apparently when you turn 15, your powers have matured enough so you can use them. Well, I'm over 15, so maybe that's that. Well, then everyone over 15 would have theirs back. Maybe a kiss is a kiss. And that just is another way. Think about it, I mean, it could happen. Maybe you're right. Well, we'll ask Eviana when she gets back. She said she was going to talk to someone two days ago and we haven't seen her. I feel like we should be worrying about her, but at the same time, I don't feel worried. I know. I'm beginning to think, maybe we shouldn't have trusted her. What are you talking about? I mean, yeah, she's Eviana and she's a little, I mean, mm -hmm. but, but she's helped us and why wouldn't we trust her? I don't know. All of a sudden I just got this really bad feeling. Um, excuse me, C can I help you? Um, this room is off limits. Unless you're in the music club. It starts at two. Oh, right. Of course. My apologies. Eviana. Hello, Isabella. Long time no see. Yes, it has been a long time. I've only been hearing from you from your phone calls. How have you been? Yes, right. My phone calls. I've been well. And Charlotte? How is she? Not as well. She... Well, she's dead. What? No, you said that she would be fine. You said that the Abaddon would spare her. What happened? I suppose I was wrong about him. She's, she's really dead? Yes, now you can cry later. I need your help with something. Can I just have a minute? No, look, I need you to do something for me. You need to re-enroll Alita at Aspen Heights. But you're the one who told me to unenroll her in the first place to make up some story. Do you know how much work it was to do that? Yes, I understand. As a principal, you have a lot to do. But you need to understand that this is very important. But you said that she can't be enrolled here. Not anymore. That that's what the Abaddon wants. That's what he needs. The people who are enrolled that go to the school are in access to more things. More things that would be helpful to the Abaddon. This, this just doesn't seem right. <laughs> oh, Isabella, I am tired of your questions. Don't ask any more questions. Just do as I say. No more questions. I'll do as you say. Excellent. We're in all the lead at this school. And don't tell anyone that I told you to. And wait, just to make it easier on me, enroll that boy Callan in the school as well, okay? Of course, Viviana. Anything you say. There you guys are. We've been looking for you. Have you guys just been sitting in here all day? Well, we can't really leave because if Miss Porter sees us, then she'll be a little confused. Since supposedly I'm supposed to be back with my foster family? I mean, who made up that story? Still trying to figure that one out. When was the last time you talked to Carol? Well, I just keep texting her, make sure she's not worried. I haven't really told her anything at all. I could see how that one's hard to explain. Hey Carol, it's been a while, sorry. A lot's been going on. I got powers, got a destiny I gotta fulfill. You know, the usual. 
Also, did you hear about that tornado? Yeah, that was me. Also, I ran away from school for a couple months. So how have you been? Ben told me you got your magic powers. You're like a magician now, right? What? No. What kind of question is that? Yeah, usually we just tune her out, but you did get your powers, right? Uh, yeah, I did. How? Uh, well, uh... We, well, I... With him, we, uh... <laughs> yeah, we, uh... <laughs> We kissed. Oh, this is getting good. You kissed? Oh, <laughs> yeah, but it transferred his power, so that's a good thing, right? Yeah, it's uh, totally fine that you kissed. I just didn't think it would transfer any powers, but I mean, I'll read up on it and I'll see. Can you like believe they kissed? Like this is insane, man. This is this. Is, what the heckity? What the heckity is going on? Shh. Sh you are being so annoying. So anyways, um, that's a cool. So are you guys like together now or something? Should, does Ben know? Is this like a, on the DL? Uh, yeah, this is, this is kind of on the DL. And no, Ben does not know, but it's fine because like, even if he did know, it'd be all right. I think I, we probably shouldn't tell him. He'd probably get a little upset. No, we definitely should tell him. I'll tell him. Uh, Brianna? <laughs> it's really not necessary for you to tell him. I think he doesn't really need to know. You should send him a picture instead. Ready? One, two, three. Callan, do not do that. <sighs> Look, um, just don't tell anyone. It'll just start drama, and that's really not what we need right now. Especially when I'm asking for all of your help. He would still help you. We all would. I know, but it's just not that important, and you don't, no one really needs to know, so we've got bigger things to worry about right now. We need to find Eviana so she can get started on your training. Training? Yeah, I can't really fight the Abaddon alone. I guess we'll go get everybody. Come on, Brianna. Um, Brianna, you can put your hand down now. I think I forgot how. <laughs> Sophia, I'm coming! She's not exactly the smartest crayon in the cram box. Not important? Huh? Callan, I didn't mean that the kiss wasn't important. No, I, I get it. Callan. You know, I get that you don't want to be in a relationship right now, that this isn't the right time or whatever, but... But I really like you and it kinda sucks. And, uh, I'm just getting better pretending that it doesn't. I'll see you around. Great. <laughs>